Hello again, it's Chip and Eddie here. This video, we visit Chip's father, Jonathan and Chris. I shoot a gun and almost fall off. And Jonathan takes me out to the lake on a high-speed miniboat. Stay tuned for all these and more. It's nice and cold out here. It's already almost five, and we're headed there. Mm -hmm. Daylight in twenty minutes. Awful house. Awful house. Yeah. Uh huh. I'm gonna get myself a classic waffle, one piece, and a biscuit and gravy, one piece, and because of the heavy carb overload today, I'm gonna die later. This is Diner Tools, salt and pepper, what is this? A tissue dispenser. Do y'all have this really in our piece of mind? Uh, no, we don't. Oh, what's this? Butter? Is this butter? With spread. Looks nice. Yes. So this is biscuit and gravy. There's bits of sausages in this. It was our last morning in Corinth and we finally found a proper coffee joint. It was a short visit but absolutely meaningful. We will be returning again in December to spend Christmas with them. Check out the sale Town Grocer. It's old and cheap. It was closed unfortunately.
S-M-R-T. I mean S-M-A-R-T. Jonathan and Chris had a very nice home, designed very much like photographs from a Southern Home magazine. And obviously, Chip and Jonathan have the same taste in exercise. This afternoon, however, I was about to be given a beginner's lesson in the sport of shooting. We drove to a shooting range nearby, which also had a vegetable patch co-managed by a few members. The yeah, he the said that they grow zucchinis. Mm -hmm. I must say, the idea of picking vegetables after practicing rounds is pretty cool. I see that there's a laser light. Does it really point that far? The laser? Yes, laser. Oh, that's nice. Well, we can kind of see where this is and we'll see where she can hit it right in there. See if we can hit that right there and that right there. There you go. Uh oh, does it look like I'm growing sideways? The magazine's not in there. All right. Okay. So you take the magazine and you put it in like that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. You flip that down right there. Okay. Mm -hmm. Then you can see that it's picked up a bullet and put it in there. Right. Okay. So then the safety is right here. 
where you see safety right there okay okay you flip that down it's ready to go okay so mm -hmm. we should be able to aim at our target and pull the trigger and go boom okay mm -hmm. got me okay okay when i hand it back to you i'll make sure it's be on safety right okay so have you ever shot before no okay perfect so all you're gonna do is a right-handed shooter mm -hmm. okay just put your arm out mm -hmm. and you're gonna take your other hand and you're gonna pull towards you pull. with this. Yes, pull. Pull. Oh, right. G is okay. left hand to pull. Yes, pull. And then that's gonna keep the Put attention. That's gonna keep it still. Okay. Okay. You with me so far? Got it. Yep. So once you get it still, you're gonna basically see the pressure. Little, little hole. You right. see a little hole? And you see the little dot right, right. there? Okay. So you line that up. Okay, and you put that and you want the three pieces, okay, to be the, the U and the dot, mm -hmm. you want them to be flat. Okay. Okay? Mm -hmm. right. As long as they're flat across, mm -hmm. and it don't matter, mm -hmm. but that's going to be the more accurate you're going to get when the three pieces are flat. Okay. Okay? Okay. Got me? Okay. okay. So, this will not kick. It's not a very okay. large gun. It's mm -hmm. very little. Okay. Okay. So it's easy. Okay. okay. Just all you're going to do is put your hand underneath it. Mm -hmm. You're going to turn around and do that right there. Okay. And you're going to just slowly pull the trick. Pull back, pull. Okay. You got it? Okay. Okay. So let's take it off safety first. All right. So let's just pick it up with safety on it first. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yep. Like yep. 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 Is it you it'll it closer to its You face can. Closer. Whatever's comfortable for you. Okay. okay. Whatever's comfortable, okay? There you go, that's perfect, okay? So then, when you take it off safety, which I'm gonna do it, okay? Mm -hmm. Don't squeeze the trigger yet. Okay? Now, swing it on the trigger, slowly pull when ready. Just keep pulling, pull the trigger. Squeeze that finger. As you can see, from the way the gun rebounds, <laughs> This is not some computer game where you press spacebar repeatedly. Perfect. Did I hit it? Don't know yet. But you got six or seven more bullets. The, okay. It'll keep shooting as you keep pulling. Okay? Nice. You look to the right. You aim for the small circle on the bottom. Nice. I want you to hit it two times real quick. Go pow, pow. Ooh, I think you got it that time. Definitely hit it. Yep, just the bottom left that time. Okay. You see this bright? Oh yeah, I do. You see the bright? Okay, so it's empty. So let's go check our target. Okay? okay. So when we check our target, we're gonna take our magazine out. How did I do? Oh, my left arm is hurting <laughs> because I'm pulling back so hard. Okay. okay. So I hit that and I hit that. Mm -hmm. And did I get anything here? The first time I around? think this one. That one? Because it just it was just these holes yeah, yeah, just correct. over here. Yeah, yeah, correct. That one. Okay. And these two. Good okay. Job. Yeah. Right. It's a lot harder than that, especially to aim when the tension is on your arm and you're trying to steady it. Okay, I didn't get any of these. Uh -oh. Oh, but I got these. two more here. Uh, and these two were here before, just, yeah. right? So you just got two more right there. Yeah. Can't tell if it's over here because all that holes in anyway, right? So it's mm -hmm. hard to tell. Hold this up. Without hitting the car. This is called wobble trap. Okay? And why it's called wobble trap is because you do the machine here and it wobbles. And this is the easiest out of all the plays that you can play. No alcoholic beverages prior to yeah, all. No more than two shells. No more than two shells. No 
more than two shells. Oh! Here comes the fun part. Well, for Jonathan, not for me. I found it a little scary. All right, let's go. Come up here with that line. I was gonna take a video. This was because of the height from which I was shooting. Look at how tightly I was gripping the bars. left-handed okay so here in the little deal okay? okay take your eye and point down the barrel like that mm -hmm. and you see the little red dot what red dot on the end of the barrel oh right okay okay you want that over the orange clay over the orange clay right where's the orange clay? i want to throw one okay you ready chip tell me when so when you say the word pull mm -hmm. he's going to push a button mm -hmm. and he's going to throw it out okay okay so I do it this way, but you can do it this way so you, when you're new. Oh! Oh, no. Okay. Okay. So we're going to do it one more time see if I can hit one. I'm going to put my ears in. So it ain't so loud on my ears. Okay. Oh! You're gonna hit it two times, okay? So the red dot over the orange. The red dot over the orange. Oh! Oh! You can't see it here, but Jonathan was really, really, really good. Each clay bird that was sent into the sky got shot into smithereens, like orange fireworks. I'm a little bitty girl and that gun was really heavy. Yup, I probably put the den into a shotgun. Okay? Don't you watch where my eye is. Okay? 
So I want you to be right behind me, okay? okay? And watch what I'm doing with that barrel, okay? Pull! Oh. Right on that clay, boom. Got me? Okay. It takes a little bit of practice. Yeah. Okay. You good? You want yeah, more? Yeah. Um, I'm good. Okay. I think uh, <laughs> this height is also a little, you know, I have to, okay, I have this drop. I did much better on the ground with the recoil, I mean, still didn't hit anything. I think I'll stick with my piano. Fun over, time to pick vegetables. I'm gonna get that zucchini. Do I just twist it? Oh, here you go. Okay. Okay. Thorny. Cucumber? Yeah. Those rat the cucumbers? Yeah. Wipe it off and eat it. It's great. Oh. Nice. Mm. How's it? Good. Fresh. Mm -hmm. Well the body. Mm -hmm. So that's what people do. They come here, they shoot a few rounds, and they come here and pick up vegetables <laughs> for dinner tonight. Those are nice. Vegetables after shooting a gun. Armed with our haul, we made our way to the house of Mr. Lonnie Melford Richards II. That's right, that's Chip's dad. We got back to the house just in time to feed their two beautiful lab dogs and then went for a boat ride around the lake out back. But before that, here's a little sneak peek of the outdoor kitchen. We have such a great time out here. Like, we will stay out there. Yeah. Like he will just, like, for hours, right? Like, you need some beer. You're, just, you're in your own little world, that's what he right? Does. Yeah. I don't know how they get more flowers than down this girl. Mm. That's because they use their John Deere. It just needs to be answered more about. It just needs to be answered more about. Sometimes I don't. So at least I get to get a plate one every once in a while. I gotta get a main in a couple of weeks too. Play off? Okay. It must be like this cup or whatever. Okay. What's that Stanley cup? Stanley cup. Kim and Mark are there. Oh, nice. Yeah. And Chris brought along a bottle of bourbon for me. That was so nice of her. 46.5% alcohol per bottle. Kentucky straight bourbon whiskey. I never heard of it. I don't know if you like it or not, but we're going to find out. It smells like bourbon. <laughs> I don't know anything. Yeah. That's as far as Chip will do with bourbon. Sniffing it. I'll do the drinking. Chip even tried his hand at steering the boat. Okay, maybe not really. Stay on the back, and all you gotta do is the ropes are gonna be on the dock. All you gotta do is just loop it straight through the middle or the other side. Don't fall over. Lock it down. You and I fish and go for a ride. You ready, Eddie? Are we? Where? Let me show you. This here is what they call the mouse. It takes you for joy rides. We'll be back in a minute. Okay, hanging on. What do you mean, good luck? <laughs> we know a lot of people on this lake.
And just when I thought I was going to freeze up from the chilly wind blowing straight into my face, we headed back to the house. There's a lot of bugs out. I should close my mouth. I know, right? I was smiling the whole time. Just slid back off. A little kind. Okay, okay. There we go. Okay. We're here now. We survived. Add that to the list. Okay, we're here. Oh, that's it? Okay. <laughs> The rest of the night was just getting dinner ready at the outdoor kitchen. Appetizers included this really really simple but amazing salad of basil, mozzarella and tomato slices, drizzled with this lovely balsamic reduction. I maybe ate only about one third of these. That is the frustrating part is that you actually can't do stuff. Right Charge them beforehand, right? I covered them, yeah. Okay. They went from green to blue. Mm. They're changing color. And then they have like rubber stoppers on the bottom. Mm -hmm. So you just put the rubber stopper on and let them clap. There or whatever. But Russell had to come in and recertify. Like every Mason fixed it. And we we're like, yeah, so you had all this family coming for lunch and your air conditioner goes out and it's super hot, but guess who fixed it? The kid who you didn't want to do HVAC. You wanted the answer. Look at you. Good. 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 Why so slow? GSTV presents Better Together with Maria Menuno. Put your puzzle Hello. together, Opa. You put all your puzzle together. <laughs> Maybe need to check some gas. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>